All right, welcome students. Um, here's a quick tutorial on how to set up a Padlet. Uh, by now you should have received a, an email that invites you to be a member of a specific class Padlet. Um, if you're uh, first, second, or fourth period, it'd be pertaining to your class. So once you, once you uh, click on that link and set up an account, the next thing you're going to want to do is add your column. Okay, so let's say your name, you know, once you click on add column, enter your name. Um, I typed in mine, Saul Martinez's art. Um, once your column is created, then you can add different pads to it. So what you're going to do is begin by clicking on this and go back to the directions on Canvas on setting up your Padlet column. Um, it says check your email for the invite. Go ahead and click on it. Create an account. You don't need a promo code. It's a free account. Create a column with your name on it. Create pads for each one of these so the pads are, depending on your class, I'm looking at um, Art Appreciation. Actually, technically I'm looking at Paint and Draw, but it doesn't matter. I'll be erasing these. But anyways, follow the four, five, or six different uh, titles on each one of these. So this one says Visual Arts Journal. Oops. And write down entries. Enter. Okay, done. Then I'm add on add a second. It says virtual gallery. Okay. And a third. Studio projects. Principles of design, etc. You won't be submitting anything here in the next week or two. Um, this is just to get yourself ready. For submissions once you're done with any particular task you submit it on here um, a common question is you know will other people will be able to see it yes but don't you worry about that right now um, this class is all about teaching you everything re related to art and one of the biggest things is to be able to communicate with others successfully um, in the art community everybody including myself I have to surround myself with people that will challenge me, but will also help me improve those skills that I lack. And I lack a lot of them. You kind of have to admit and you have to accept that you don't know everything. And for the most part, you don't know anything. Um, and it's, it's through um, exterior wisdom. So wisdom that you can't find within your own brain. You kind of have to allow other people to influence you, push you, challenge you, and then from there you grow. And so that's what community is all about. Um, and the last one's other. Okay. Let me explain what Padlet is. Padlet is a great way to display your work. Um, so if you click on here, hold up. I'll click on right. Um, you have an upload, you have a hyperlink, you have a web link, you can add a photo. And there's a variety of other things you can do. Um, don't necessarily worry about it right now, but but there's so many different possibilities for a Padlet um, depending on what you want to exhibit. So if it's a film, it's a, it's a film. If it's a link to your gallery, let's say like for your virtual gallery, you put your link right there. Um, I will add more videos kind of showing each one of these little functions, but you can play around. If you don't like it, you delete it, and then you try something else. If you can't figure it out, you email me, message me on Remind. I'll be there to help you. So that's a simple kind of uh, just a tutorial on how do you set up your Padlet. Here is where you will submit all of your work. All right, thank you. Again, if you want to get a hold of me, my Remind app code is NHHSAR. Um, my email is smartinez at psd1.org. Good luck.